guys, KP Shamino here with another guide tutorial for Star Citizen and this time it's for the quest, the Com Arai on uh, Crusader Olisar or Port Olisar. So I'm going to show you guys how you need to do it. So first of all, how can you check what kind of quest you got? You just need to push F9. So just push F9 and you come in like a very nice menu. And if you go over here to the MG Shatteler, you can just click on it and you will see your quests that are available for you at this moment. And this quest is what we are going to do. So restore local communication. So pirates uh, are disrupting the communication and you need to get all those different arrays back online. So here you will see it. If we complete one quest, you can just, you will see that the quest is done. You see like a little uh, V in front of it. So that's how you can see it. So let's go back. You just click here at the bottom. And then you close the MG again. And it's time to lift up guys. So here we go. Okay, we are off. Let's get a little bit speed in this ship. Okay, let's go to cruise mode and off we are so now you don't see a lot here so what you need to do is you need to push b and you will see right away there is like a lot of destinations and in every destination name you will see the quest that you can do there so here you see you can do the com array 126 here you can do another com array com array so we are going to do this com array 126 so what you do is you just put your marker on the destination and you need to push middle mouse button or the wheel mouse button so just click on it and you will see you go in hyperspeed yeah it's a lot faster of course otherwise it will take like ages until you are at the station and now you are there in like five seconds and you will see right away there is a station so that's where you need to get the array back online but as you guys will see right away there are some uh, pirates too so let's we need to kill a couple of pirates first because otherwise if i land now it's possible but it's very very difficult because they keep shooting at you and you're like a sitting duck on that station you cannot do shit if they are shooting you so let's get a couple of pirates out let's try to get them out of course let's try to follow him I think we got three still to go, so let's try to target that dude. Yeah, 400 meters. So let's follow him, shoot a little bit. Just in time, because I think it was really close. 
Okay, where did he go? He's totally... Yeah, that's one again dead. So I think we are now okay. So I think there are only one, two, two of them. So let's go to the station. Because I don't want to waste too much time on uh, this tutorial. I mean in movie time. So what you need to do is... Okay, I need to... Oh. Yeah, that was close. So be sure that you don't go too fast. So now I went back to precision. And if I shake it right, there it is. So you will see it. Here is the array. So that's how you can check it. So it's a little bit at the top of uh, of the station. So now we are going to land on this station. So just go a little bit faster, but not that fast. Because be sure that you are going to precision mode. Because otherwise you are going way too quick. And we are going to try to land over here. So let's go to speed zero and let's start going down with uh, with F. So we strafe down now. That was. Uh, oh, Thanks for the assist. Things were looking a little tight. Okay. Uh, if you got a second, we could use your help with one more thing. Albos keep shut down comrades in the area. I think we are okay. Let's go to the other camera view. Yeah. Here you will see it. So my spaceship is okay. Now we are going to exit the spaceship. And you need to go uh, further in EVE mode, they call it. So that means outside your ship. Because you cannot fly like in Star Wars, in the Death Star with your with your ship all the way uh, yeah, in it. Here it doesn't work like that. So let's get outside. It's not far anymore. So... Uh, yeah, here we are and we are flying. I will show you guys how it looks. So this is how it looks. You just need to uh, use the keys that you are using uh, when you are just running around. So now we need to watch. I think it was just in front of me if I'm not mistaken. It can be on the other side too. So now you need to watch. Or need to find, sorry. The entrance. So... Uh, Let's go a little bit up. I thought it was... I was really close. But I guess it's on the other side. So you can just fly. I will go You'll back to... to, get to the ah, here it is. So here you will see it. And what you need to do now is you need to go inside. It doesn't look that you can go inside. But you can. So just fly inside. Oh. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Yeah, and now we are inside the station. Okay, a little bit more. And at the bottom here, you will see there is like some computers. And that's the array. So that's the stuff that we need to get back online. Okay. So let's have a look where it is. I'm just flying around this uh, like generator or something or supercomputer. I'm not sure what it is, but here it is. Here you will see it, guys. So let's let's break a little bit with uh, with my suit. And if you come closer, you will see you can use it. There and if you clear. use it, Go ahead, reset the array. if you use it, the uplink is back online. The array is resetted. And normally I'm going to get on my screen that I did this quest. Yeah, it's not coming, but let's check the Moby Glass again, F9. Let's go to the quest. Let's have a look. And you will see here that I restored the uplink at COM Array 126 and the quest is complete. So that was it guys, thanks for watching to my movie, if you like the movie give me a like please, if you like my channel subscribe, otherwise have fun with Star Citizen and be careful there in space because otherwise it's possible you die, bye bye.